tell you what, you take one for yourself and one for your little sunny boy there. My mother said, oh no, thank you very much. We'll be on our way now. Would you reckon I've ever forgiven my mother for this? No, sorry, Bob. Because I saw on the Interline web service, have you ever been on one of those goggle searches before? So I was doing a little goggle search, and I found out that one of the paintings sold for $3.7 million. So I would have had a much different inheritance. I would have been able to afford private health care for my uh, darn herniated disc operation. Had to wait 17 weeks for that health care benefit to kick in. So I want you to know two very important what I call facts of life. Uh, you must live with every moment of every day with your utmost potential and you will have a very happy and, uh, and prosperous life. And uh, the other thing is, if anyone offers you anything for free, you better doggone take it. Now, <laughs> except drugs. Don't do drugs, kids. Oh! <laughs> the National Bird of Victoria Pettycab over here, Ryan. Yeah. Uh, uh, they're just off the mating season. And then the movie one? Hollyhock. Yep. Oh, yeah. You have more. You have some, Kieran. Andre always has pe good peanuts in there. Yeah. Yeah. He's got in his pouch there in the front. Oh, he doesn't have any more, eh? <laughs> oh no, I made a mistake. <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> I do laugh to yoga. We also have a museum here, a World First Columbia Museum, and it's some of the oldest uh, totem poles around. They almost tore it down this year. They had an $800 million budget to build a new museum, and the citizens said, no, we can't do it. They want to And that's their whole job. They start at 10.30, 11 o'clock, they have a right-hand drive, go with their water wand, and give it a good squirt of water, water to keep everything alive. Look, there's sunshine up there. Yeah, I think it's coming here.
Francis Boston Radford, he was only 25 years old when he won the commission for this building. And he beat out 59 other architects to get it. Do you think he told the truth on his resume? He was just a rookie. No. He actually lied completely on his resume. One of the buildings he designed or claimed to have designed was designed 15 years before and he was only 25. That would have made him 10 years old and probably doing chalk art on the pavement, right? Back in the day. Beautiful um, yes. mother and baby orca. Uh, yeah. This takes 2,800 different. Well. Hey guys, how are you? Are you guys on the ship too? Yeah. Are you on the cruise ship? Yeah. They're from the cruise ship, the quantum of the seas out there. Yeah. And they're from India and Connecticut. 